All right, so we have the inverter charging the batteries at 6,000 watts right now, coming from a 7,000 watt continuous uh, generator and I think it does 9,000 peak. But she's working hard out there. You can probably just barely hear it in here. It's 100 amps coming in there and then we got 17 amps coming in here and 14 amps coming in here. So we got about 130 amps coming in. They're reliable is running. That's what's running uh, the house and everything right now with through the 10,000 watt transformer. Yeah, everything's working great. Not a lot of solar today, so just decided to test out the charging feature of this. I think we're gonna keep it at about 6,000 watts. I don't want to overtax the generator. I feel like uh, 6,000 watts is plenty. Yeah, it's awesome. So we can quick charge. That leaves me with 20% uh, to run the rest of the house. So that's only 1,000 watts approximately to run the rest of the house. Um, and this will scale back as I use more. But anyways, that's awesome. System's working great. Pretty happy with the, just the fact that I can charge so fast now through a generator. So 6,000 watts, that's, that's pretty much uh, what my system brings in in full sunlight right now at this time of year. Actually, my system brings in 6,600 watts. But uh, it's nice to be able to run this like this. Probably let it go up to 62 volts and then I'll just shut it off. Just giving it a test because I have the most I've put on this uh, generator so before. This was 4,000 watts and that wasn't charging the batteries. I was just running the house. Now we're actually charging the batteries. So that's great. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. And here we have the generator working real hard. It's quite a bit louder when it's. Uh got such a load on it, but... Four hours. It's about time to do an oil change now. After this, I'll probably do an oil change. Wires are cool. Plug is cool. So with the generator running and solar coming in, we got almost 9,000 watts coming in. Nope, now we got over 9,000 watts coming in, charging. Oh boy, I'm gonna have to shut that. If the sun comes out and we hit over 6,000 watts here and 6,000 watts with the generator, I'm gonna have to watch these BMS to make sure they can handle it because I believe the charge current is only about 10 amps per BMS and I got 13 of them, so I can do it about 100. 130 amps continuous. They seem they don't seem to be getting warm yet, so this one gets warm warmest the soonest because it's on the shortest wires. They all seem to be okay. Nothing seems to be warm yet. Definitely gonna keep an eye on it though. Also wires. Wires are all nice and cool. Nothing's warm here. Nope, still Still not warm, and we got quite a bit of power coming in. Turn the batteries pretty quickly. I'm gonna watch these. Uh, these they're not getting too many amps. They'll probably only be getting a few amps. Actually, let's take a look and see uh, how many amps. Set this thing to. Just set to 40 amps. I'm gonna zero it out, and let's go to battery. Let's just go battery negative. Come on. There we go. This battery is seeing 17 amps going into it right now. That's the Nissan Leaf battery. Let's try... What other battery should we try? Let's try this one. This one's got 11.6 amps going to it. Uh, where is this one? No, let's go like this. It's got 10 amps going to it. Another one here. Uh, this one here. This one's got seven amps going into it. But different size batteries, so you get different size or different amounts of current as well. 
You're doing pretty good. Anyways, thanks for watching. Sorry for, sorry for the shaky camera. How's it going, guys? Just give you an update on the wind turbine. Making some power today. Making about the same power that this one's making, about 300 watts continuous ish. A little bit more, sometimes a little bit less. This is just PWM, same voltage as the batteries, this sucker right here. Oh, we got it uh, one died right down. It's going back up. So oh, that's that. It's only a few hundred watts. This one's putting in more. 500 watts, so gives you a good idea. A quick update. Gotta get that thing higher. Hopefully, gonna do that uh, this summer. Anyways, thanks for watching. Check it out, guys. Got a new meter up. This is meter is for this charge controller because it doesn't have a screen at all. So I tested this with my clamp meter, and it seems to be quite accurate. Well, within a few watts, anyways. There you go, we got up to 300 watts there for a bit. Just hooked it up, as you can see. So now, you'll actually be able to see what I'm making. So we got watts there. We got uh, 200 watts coming in here. We got 200 watts-ish, 100, 160 going up and down. And we got 200 coming in here. So, that's pretty cool. Finally got something up for this charge controller. These things are nice and cheap. I can't remember where I bought it. I think it was eBay. I had to buy the shunt separate. I think this was only like 10 bucks. The shunt was also 10 bucks. For 20 bucks, you get one of these meters. Uh, if you're interested, I might. Uh, I'll try and put it the description or a link in the description below. But uh, yeah, it's it's fairly windy out. It's not like crazy amounts of windy, but it's uh, windy enough where I wouldn't want to be sheeting on a roof. That's what we were doing today. Uh, yeah. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Oh, well, we're making some good power now. Let's see if I'll keep putting out the power, because usually you take the camera out, and there goes the wind. <laughs> 422 there. I only had 17. Oh, it's picking up. And 383. There we go. It's getting gusts. Anyways, let's go take a look outside. So it's a bit windy. It's nothing crazy. It is windy though, but it just the wind seems to be coming from a good uh, angle for the wind turbine. At least fairly good. Here goes my screen door. Yeah, it's going pretty good actually. If I could only get it a little higher. It's coming from the northwest. It feels like anyways from where, where I'm standing. Alright, that's a good gust. Okay. I'll be making some power there. Anyways, thanks for watching guys, hope you enjoyed this update.